question number 241 dy by dx plus y by 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 is equal to x plus 1 minus x square raised to 1 by 2 by 1 minus x square the whole square the given di differential equation is in a is a linear equation and it's in the standard form the standard form being dy by dx plus p of y equal to q where p and q are functions of x alone here p is equal to 1 by 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 and q is equal to x plus 1 minus x square raised to 1 by 2 by 1 minus x square the whole square so for differential for such differential equation integrating factor can be found out by e raised to in using the formula e raised to p dx here so this becomes e raised to 1 by 1 minus x square the whole raised to 3 by 2 dx so we need to integrate this to find the integrating uh, the integrating factor so we will do that separately so 1 by 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 dx so here for such integrals what we do is put substitution mm, use x is equal to sin theta sorry sin theta as the substitution so dx becomes cos theta d theta so we will use this so this becomes integral 1 by 1 minus x square sin square which is cos square so cos square raised to 3 by 2 cos square theta raised to 3 by 2 um, so and dx becomes cos theta 1 into cos theta d theta so cos cube by cos again this all cancels and becomes integral sec square theta sec square theta d theta so integral sec square theta is um, tan theta so this integral is tan theta so we can put that here so tan theta what is tan theta tan th theta is uh, sin theta is x so sin theta by cos theta or that is equal to sin theta is x x by root of 1 minus x square right so we so this is our integral in terms of x so here we are going to substitute this becomes okay we will re we just write brush integrating factor is equal to e raised to integral 1 by 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 dx which we found out e raised to integral sorry that integral is this so e raised to x by root of 1 minus x square this is our integrating factor now solution for such differential equation is given by y into integrating factor is equal to integral integrating factor into q dx plus c so y into e raised to x by root 1 minus x square equal to integral integrating factor so e raised to x by root 1 minus x into q what was q q was this term so i'm just i'll just copy this into this okay so this is q 
this whole into dx plus c. So we have x by root of 1 minus x square here. So we will do one thing again use the substitution a x by root of 1 minus x square equal to t. Now we have to differentiate this in the u by v form. So root of 1 minus x square into u by v, v into du u plus 1 minus u into x into differential of root of 1 minus x square. So which is minus so 1 minus x square by rise to 1 by 2. So again 1 by 2 into root minus x square minus 2x so this by this square so 1 minus x square dx equal to dt which implies is also further simplifying we get mm, going to get cancel minus minus x becomes x square so if you take this to top 1 minus x square 1 minus x square plus x square by root of 1 minus x square that is 1 plus 1 by 2 so 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 dx equal to dt so x square x square cancels so we get 1 by 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 dx equal to dt now we can use this into this integral so this becomes let's call this one let's call this two so using two in one we have y into e rise to um, integral x e raised to x by root of one minus x square is equal to integral so e raised to uh, x by root of 1 minus x square becomes e raised to t e raised to t into so since we have uh, this here so we will do one thing we need 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 in the bottom right so we will divide this whole term with 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 so for now so let's so x so let me just what 1 minus x square raised to 1 by 2 if you divide this terms becomes 1 and this becomes x by root of 1 minus x square and this term becomes 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 so i am going to write that here so x by root of 1 minus x square plus 1 by 1 minus x square raised to 3 by 2 uh, dx plus c so now this 1 by 1 minus x square dx becomes dt so this is equal to y into e raised to x by root 1 minus x square equal to integral e raised to t now x by 1 minus x square is again t so 1 plus t so 1 by this term becomes dt so this dt plus c so now we have this 
simplified this into a simple integral now um, let's take this as a first function and this as the second function and integrate this using integration by parts so this becomes 1 plus t as function differential of second function is e raised to t itself minus differential of first function differential of first function is 1 so into integral of second so e raised to t so e integral of e raised to t it's e raised to t itself so i am just going to remove this minus e raised to t sorry e raised to t plus c y into e raised to x by root so now we can substitute for t so we have y into e raised to x by so just one moment if this is just nothing but e raised to t so if i just write e raised to t here and divide throughout by e raised to t we get y equal to 1 plus t minus 1 so again you open up this becomes just t so if you open this up e raised to t plus t e raised to t minus e raised to t e raised to t cancels so t into e raised to t uh, and e raised to t goes so y equal to mm, t plus c into e raised to minus t okay so now substituting for t we have x by root 1 minus x square plus c into e raised to x by root 1 minus x square sorry minus x minus x into so this is the solution so this is a good question it has many complicated com not complex but difficult integrals we can say so there are many substitutions i will just mark this important step substituting this substitution is important then again finding the integral of this this is a difficult one we can say so this is a good question uh, these are the steps to solving this first we need to identify it is a linear differential equation then apply the solution so fair amount of steps are involved in solving this question so these are the steps this is the solution to question number 241 I'll just mark this important.